most vile day to you all. It's Monday, which means it's vlog day. I am Adam from Noble Command and Future Painting, and I hope you're having a brilliant start to your week. Ha! So, we are going to kick start things off with Future Painting side of things, and I'm going to let you all know that a new blog went up this weekend from Matthew Davis of Power Armored Metal, and that is a guide on how to fix up cheap models. So, say you went to eBay and was a pro-painted model, uh, don't like the colour scheme, but it only costs like a few quid, so you want to like clean it up and repaint it, make it look epic. He's got a guide on how to go ahead and do that. So head over to the <coughs> my Squidoo page, it's on the Future Painting website, which is linked under here, and you can go ahead and look at that, and that's a pretty awesome source. So look out for next week's. Um, and I'll give you the updates in a week on that, and that's on the Facebook page, which will also be underneath this video. Okay, so, second thing today is quite exciting. I was approached by the International Brotherhood of Hobbyists to sponsor their painting competition. Now, they are doing a speed painting competition with the theme of, and I can find it, uh, 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 I think the theme is Scouting Party, yes it is indeed. A five man scouting party squad of any games range, it doesn't have to be Warhammer, it could be War Machine or Infinity or some other game system, anything you like, as long as it's, you know, whatever. So it's pretty cool, it kinda, it's pretty awesome to be able to sponsor such a, you know, it might not be the biggest event in the universe, but it's cool and I'm very proud to be able to sponsor the back of it. So, some rules and prizes are on their website which is going to be linked underneath this video. And the prizes are, first place is a set, a 10 base set of secret weapon miniatures, 25mm resin bases. Uh, secret weapon miniatures are very nice indeed for their bases. So that's pretty cool and along with that from myself you also get one of these to go with the bases. So that's got the glue, as you can see, it's got some like snow, it's got some grass flocky in there, it's got some of the uh, I think that's meant to be rocks, I think it is, I can't remember off the top of my head. And you get some swamp tuft as well, which is pretty awesome. And the runner up also gets one of these. So there's two of these up for grabs, and there's a random prize which they have yet to determine, so I'm not sure what's going on with that. But if you want to go ahead and enter, it starts this weekend on Saturday the 18th, uh, goes on for a week, and then I get to judge it. So can't wait to do that, it's going to be awesome. <laughs> so yeah, go ahead and follow the link in the description if you want to go ahead and join. I strongly suggest you do because it's just something cool to do. So go ahead and do that. I've shared it over everything, so spam them with stuff, it's awesome. So, what else is going on with Future Painting this week? Well, I plan to go somewhere and design a proper reviews page. At the moment, you can only leave a review on a product, not an entire order. So, I would like to give the ability to be able to let people put a proper full review on the website so everyone can see what I'm all about, if they had their order all properly, and you know, like, you, like a normal website basically, you know. So look out for that. If you've got any ideas, however, please put them in the comments below or f go to Facebook and leave a comment on the Facebook page or email me at futurepainting uh, at gmail.com. So that's pretty much all it is for Future Painting. There's not crazy amounts going on at the precise moment, but uh, I'm waiting for stock to come in and you know whatever. I'm trying to get some photos done and all that jazz. So, like I said, if you want to follow me on Facebook, it is facebook.com forward slash future painting. The Twitter is at future painting and that's updated with Facebook so as I put status on Facebook it'll pop it up onto Twitter and all that jazz. If you want to go ahead and have a bit of a browse, a bit of a shop, uh, then go ahead to my web store which is www.futurepainting.co.uk which will all be linked underneath this video here. So yeah, cool. Um, next up is the putrid rotten bile that is Nurgle Command, and we are going to talk about the awesome apocalypse that, uh, that me and Kevin Rowland from the Triliga Reavers went to 
it was absolutely blindingly awesome and I would love to do it again. There were about 25k's worth of points of armies each side. Um, it was quite funny because on the Imperial side there were Night Lord Chaos Space Marines because someone pulled out unfortunately so we had to like kind of drag someone in to like fill up the space. So that's who I was against. I was against so it was Chaos versus Chaos which was very fun indeed when it came to close quarters because it was like I challenge you! Okay! And then ah god damn it. No, no challenges could be avoided so it was quite fun. Um, it ended up with quite a clear table on our side because it, despite me being Nurgle and plus one toughness and it was still quite an even fight because he had crazy amounts of awesome stuff including bipedal defilers which has given me a brilliant idea for a demon prince um, I'm going to have a look around and see if I can do a conversion of a soul grinder slash defiler slash demon prince so it can either be a demon prince or it can be a defiler but it will be made from I think the body of the soul grinder excuse me, with some other bits and bobs, but I'm not too sure what to do for the legs yet, whether to use the legs from the Soul Grinder, or get some different legs. So if you have any suggestions, please, please give them to me, and I will look them up and see what I can do with it. But I think it's going to be a brilliant project, and I think you guys will enjoy it loads to see me do that. So, what else is there going on with Noble Command? Well, hopefully, I do apologise, I did say last week I would make a start on the Chaos Warriors from the Warriors of Chaos Army, and I have not had the time or anything to get them started, so apologies on no updates on them. I'm going to try my very best to start them this week. Uh, it won't be today, because I've got loads of stuff to do today. Um, but look out for it from tomorrow onwards, where I will be doing some painting, and I will update you on the Facebook page, which will be linked underneath here. Uh, tonight I'm going down to the Tridiga Reavers, um, not as opposed to painting, but I'm going as myself uh, to go and play, hopefully, if <laughs> someone responds on the Facebook page, it'll either be somebody random or I would like to go against Kevin, because I have some very big and finished business with his evangelists, uh, keep whacking typhus off, it's mean. So I'm going down there tonight, uh, if you want to go and check out what they're about, there'll be a link underneath here for them, uh, with their Facebook page and their website. So, big news for me, quite exciting news for me, that I've like been buzzed about since I've heard about it. Some of you may have heard about the Wargamers Consortium. It was a YouTube channel uh, featuring the likes of Chung, the Joey Berry, Les from Awesome Paint Job, other individuals such as Wargamer Spud Tate, Fear GFX, the Warhammer Lady, and God, oh, good lord, just so many other awesome, huge, well, to me and other people, huge Wargamer YouTubers. And they were basically tutorials and live shows, and it basically started growing into this beast of a, of a thing. Um, and they started off a Facebook page uh, for social and community aspects and it grew quite well but it was very limited with Facebook so what Chung went and did is he completely coded out and did a brand new website for it with a forum and I'm a part of that project and I'm extremely proud to be part of that project um, <laughs> and I'm a regulator which is like a moderator but we don't like the word moderator because that's like everyone assumes like evil man with ban hammer but no um, I'm there to keep the peace and keep the chat rolling so I'm pretty awesomely excited and Mario of uh, the voices of Mars will tell you like, I was like screaming at him because I was like I can't contain my excitement anymore <laughs> but yeah <laughs> There'll be a link to the Wargamers Consortium page in the description underneath this video. Please come ahead and come on to us because it's filled with awesome knowledge from painting tutorials all the way down to <laughs> pet talk and cooking and everything. There's everything you can think of. It's not just Wargaming. It's the main subject. However, there is a community site and there's lifestyle stuff in there. So if you want to just come along and flit to talk about whatever you like, then feel free to come along if you want to come to the Wargamers Consortium Forums to better yourself as a Wargamer, painter, modeler, converter, whatever then we welcome you with open arms and we hope to see you there and look forward to your posts. So, if you want to follow me on any sort of means then go ahead and follow me on Facebook that's facebook.com forward slash Nurgle Command the Twitter is 
at Noble Command, and that's the same as Future Painting. It's updated via Facebook and all that jazz, so I don't have to lazily go onto Twitter and do updates and crap, which is awesome. If you want to send me any pictures, send me any messages, or whatever, you can do that via Facebook as well, or you can email me directly, and that is noblecommand at gmail.com. And that's probably going to be about it for now, guys. So, hope you enjoyed this video, and I will see you next week for a, another vlog. Have yourselves a very disgusting day.